The broadcast is now starting. All attendees are in listen-only mode. Thanks again, uh, travel agents, for joining us today, July 26, 2017, um, on our One of Awards webinar. We have Sandals Resorts and Unique Vacations to present for us today and give us our Jamaica training. Um, simple runner show as always, keeping it simple and effective. Uh, at 2.05, I'm going to again go to Sandals and Unique Vacations with our presenter today, Susan Granger, who is a Senior Business Development Manager. 20-minute uh, presentation, she can use daytime however she pleases to, to do the training and we'll get to our questions and answers right after. Um, anything that we don't get to within the session, we will get to you after um, via email. So we encourage you to um, to send you those questions. If we don't get to them on the session, you can send it to Susan herself, uh, which will share the email, or you can get it to myself at kdacosta at visitjamaica.com. Um, again, all of this is brought to you by the Jamaica Tourist Board and our One Level Awards program, where we give you all information, support, and rewards for your support of Jamaica. So we're going to get to Susan um, and you I'll leave this up for a little while so you can have her information as I give her control. Over to you Susan. Okay. Okay thank you Chris and good afternoon everybody and uh, Chris thank you for inviting Sandals to be the presenter today at this webinar. We appreciate the opportunity and uh, always welcome presenting to our travel partners. As Chris said, I'm uh, the Senior Business Development Manager for the Northeast Region, and I have to tell you that I am very, very passionate about the country of Jamaica. It's one of the most beautiful places in the world, and I recommend that if you haven't seen any of the Sandals resorts within the past year, to take this opportunity to, to to go to the resort and see them. They, they are luxury all-inclusive. Uh, they're privately owned by a gentleman named uh, Gordon Butch Stewart. His son is the CEO, Adam Stewart, and lots of changes over the past year in reference to our resort. What we're gonna go over uh, this afternoon are things you will enjoy on a Sandals vacation. The most recent updates at our Jamaica resorts, of which there have been many, and marketing tools and ideas to help you grow your business by booking the Sandals Resorts in Jamaica and the advantage of booking directly with unique vacations. As I mentioned, Gordon Butch Stewart is the chairman of Sandals and Beaches Resorts and we are very proud that we are celebrating our 35th year in business. And when you're vacationing and sending your clients to a Jamaica Sandals or Beaches Resort, um, we're, we're very free. It's a product that you can sell with full confidence. A brand you can trust. We've been voted the world's leading all-inclusive company for 20 war 21 consecutive years in a row. Uh, we're a brand you can trust to deliver more than you've ever expected. No other hospitality group comes close to offering more in both quantity and quality inclusion, which is why Sandals Resorts are the most awarded all-inclusive resorts ever. We're world's leading all-inclusive resorts. A lot of changes, um, a lot of updates, and we'll start with the butler service as well as the club services that we offer at our Jamaica resorts. Um, the butler would be your top of the line accommodations. Um, when you hear me say club sandals, I'm referring to specifically the sandals resort. When you hear me say concierge, then I'm referring to beaches. Now, the difference being when you're in a club category room, it will include room service. Um, we have seven sandals resorts in Jamaica, and we have two beaches resorts in Jamaica. And the, the concierge would be applicable, as I mentioned, to the beaches resort. Um, we have also in Jamaica one Grand Pineapple Resort, and we offer the ability when you're in an area such as Montego Bay, where we have three resorts, you can stay at one, play at all. In the Montego Bay area, we have three resorts geographically, which are very close to each other. So no matter which one you book your clients at, they would have accessibility to all three of those resorts. We have new restaurant concepts um, that we started at our resorts, one being an Indian cuisine, which is called Bombay Club at several of the resorts, and the other is our steakhouses, which would be called Butch's Chop House. Uh, many of you are aware that we have partnerships, uh, one being with Appleton Estates, 
which is based in Jamaica. And we have a partnership with Appleton Rum and also a partnership with Robert Mondavi Wine. So we're very consistent when going to the resorts, whether you um, go to a beaches resort, uh, which is the one in Ochi, or you go to the one in Negril, or whether you're at one of the Montego Bay resorts in Jamaica, or uh, one of the ones in the Ocho Rios area, we're consistent in terms of the beverages that we offer and the partnership is indicative of why the consumers continue to go back to Sandals over and over again. And you can even venture out and do a tour to the Appleton Rum Estate while you're in Jamaica vacationing. And another one of our partnerships and something we're very proud of is the uh, the coffee that we offer, which is the Blue Mountain Coffee. And in my opinion, it is hands down the best coffee in the world. It's grown exclusively in Jamaica's misty Blue Mountain range. Jamaica's Blue Mountain Coffee possesses an unmatched superior flavor, and it's included throughout all of our specialty restaurants. Every single one of the resorts in the Jamaica area, is, we would offer the Blue Mountain Coffee. And then oftentimes, you know, today especially, you have a lot of uh, individuals that have food allergies. They have to have a balanced lifestyle, or it could be they're vegans or vegetarians, or they may be lactose intolerant or gluten-free. Whatever it is, we will customize that vacation for your client so that we meet their needs. So if they have nut allergies, it's just a matter of you communicating with our customer service department so that we can meet the needs and the desires and the wishes of the customer so that's then when they go to vacation, they don't have to worry about a thing. We'll make sure that their dietary needs are met based on what their allergies are. In terms of the accommodations that they're going to get, well, our love nest suites are the top of the line. So you're going to have in every single room your satellite LED televisions. Uh, many of our resorts offer pillow menus, the Egyptian cotton linens. Um, you have seating areas, unbelievable views, even more so than what we had before in terms of how we've opened up the rooms where you have this amazing visual of the ocean for those beachfront and those ocean view accommodations at the resorts in Jamaica. You're going to hear me say a lot about tranquility soaking tubs. Those are really huge now. We do offer those at the resorts in Jamaica where you can literally walk out. You have Crystal Lagoon uh, rooms where you walk out and you have uh, your, your pool area, direct views of the ocean, uh, offering you privacy curtains with the tranquility soaking tub. So you're, what you're looking at in this visual is a couple in their crystal lagoon outside of their patio. But if you notice to the left, you'll see a curtain. So that offers a privacy so that they can close that curtain. Remember, Sandals is a resort exclusively for couples. Beaches is for everybody, but honing in primarily to families. So if you're a couple and you're going to one of the Sandals resorts in Jamaica, you can close the curtain when you want to have that privacy and enjoy um, your, your tranquility soaking tub. So it's beyond the traditional concept of rest and relaxation because what Sandals is about, it's about romance, it's about rediscovering each other, it's about just experiencing everything you can possibly want to do to make it a spectacular vacation and that's what you want to do for your clients. So it's something, the best moments in life are the simple ones, really. Sometimes that's, that's all it takes. You're looking for the simplicity of just reconnecting, or maybe you want to just be around other couples to learn to get to know other people. You'll find that people go to Sandals tend to be repeat guests. We have a very, very high percentage of repeat guests specifically to the Jamaica area. And you'll find that a lot of times couples will meet each other, and they're from different parts of North America, and they reconnect vacation again a year later, six months later, two, but two years later, based on couples they may have met during that vacation experience. So as I mentioned, we have seven sandals in Jamaica, and we have two beaches. In the Ocho, you're looking at a map right now, and of course, let me not um, be remiss and not mention the infamous Bob Marley. The, uh, who doesn't love Bob Marley music? And uh, as we may or may not know, Bob Marley was born and raised in Jamaica. We have Bolt, who is, um, for the past four years, the fastest runner in the world. Um, as I mentioned, the Blue Mountain Coffee. The national fruit is the Aki. Um, we have amazing falls in Jamaica, such as Duns River Falls, um, and falls near the area of uh, White House, 
where we have a resort called Sandal South Coast. Um, in Montego Bay, the three resorts. In the grill, we have a Sandals, we have a Beaches, and in Ocho Rios, we have a Beaches Resort, which is a family resort, and we have the two Sandals. One would be Sandals Royal Plantation, and the other would be Sandals Ochi Beach Resort. So consistency and raising the expectations of our clients with major completed projects, which I'm going to start by touching on. Number one, Sandals Montego Bay. It's our very, very first resort, which opened 35 years ago. Um, it's known to be a true beachfront resort where the party never stops. Um, it's, we completely are presenting to you a new brand. If you haven't seen this resort in a year, you really need to take advantage of using nights that you've earned by your bookings or going down on a travel agency rate so you can see how magnificent this resort is. It happens to be on a magnificent stretch of beach, White Sand Beach, which offers you spectacular views of the ocean. What you're looking at are new refurbishments, lots of new refurbishments at this resort. Um, we've done uh, completely redone the entranceway with magnificent ocean views. Um, this is, and again, I'm sure you're saying, and I can't hear you oohs and ahs, but this is the new lobby of this particular resort. Has, it has truly been completely transformed of what it looked like a little over a year ago. It's gorgeous, it's very open, it's very airy, it offers you magnificent views of the ocean. This was a before, and let me tell you, this resort is hot and heavy, lots of people come here, we get lots of repeat guests. Um, it was sort of like a sunken living room vibe, if you will. Uh, lots of fun, very upbeat, people loved it, but we, we are going with what the consumer of today is, look is looking for. And this is as you're entering the lobby looking out, you have an open, airy, direct view of the ocean. Um, Six million dollar renovations have been spent at this particular resort. And what you're looking at now is an over the water new lobby bar at Sandals Montego Bay. So as you can see, changing the game is what we're all about in the all inclusive industry. Here is in uh, Sandals Montego Bay, a beachfront one bedroom butler suite with a tranquility soaking tub. Again, you're gonna hear me say that word a lot because that's new, that's what's in, and that offers the romance and privacy at the end of the day where you can reconnect with your partner. Um, a one bedroom butler suite, a visual, a better visual of that tranquility soaking tub. As you can see right out on your deck, or it would be right out on your patio with a little area, uh, two chairs for dining or just having a cocktail. What you're looking at here is a before picture of a beachfront honeymoon walkout club level junior suite. This is a before, and this is what it looks like now. So you can see the difference uh, it's in terms of the openness, the airiness, the contemporariness of today, what today's consumer is looking for. Again, not bad, quite beautiful. A couple of years ago, this was our bathroom with uh, out the tranquility soaking tubs, but this is what they look like now open air, you know, wide um, shower heads that come from the top, um, very contemporary, very, very modern. And this is the beachfront Romeo and Juliet one bedroom villa suite with outdoor tranquility soaking tub. Visually, you can see the tranquility tub. You have two accommodations on the lower level and two upstairs. Direct oceanfront rooms what you're this, this is beachfront you walk out and the beach is right there these particular um accommodations were built many many years ago and they're they're literally sitting right on the beach and nowadays when you build in the caribbean everything has to be set back but what we did was we completely gutted these refurbished them modernized them and they're completely new and fabulous and this is the interior as you're looking into the room from your deck uh, or from your balcony. This is a beachfront Romeo and Juliet, one bedroom butler villa suite, again with the outdoor tranquility soaking tub, looking in from the outside, and this is looking out from your bedroom. You have a direct beachfront view. And here's a better visual of the tranquility soaking tub with your beachfront view. Okay, and again, this is the Romeo and Juliet one bedroom butler villa suite with outdoor tranquility soaking tub. This is a before picture. Again, lovely. It's, you know, a little closed in with the doors, uh, the um, circular door, but as you can see, we've opened it up significantly where from your bedroom through your living area, you have a direct view of the ocean. And this is the millionaire one bedroom butler suite. 
and from this is actually from your balcony what your visual would be what your visual is okay a few befores and i know for those of you on the call that are seasoned you remember this look which was great but it is i say significant transformation from the sandals montego bay of what you remember from a few years back a beachfront millionaire one bedroom butler suite with tranquility soaking top now we're going to go about 10 minutes away to sandals royal caribbean um, this is what we'd like to say, Britain to Bali, exotic adventures in Jamaica. Um, at this resort, we have 227 rooms and suites. There are 24 categories, 15 acres, and you're about 10 minutes away from the airport. Sandals, Montego Bay, it's about five minutes away. This is 10 minutes away. And you do have exchange privileges at this resort between the other two Sandals resorts. So I want to mention that. A lot of major changes, a lot of really great additives to this resort. This is the resort. We have, we have the offshore private island. It takes less than five minutes to get over there. Um, we have over at this island a Royal Thai restaurant, which has been newly renovated, pool and bar. We have Wi-Fi, two spa treatment rooms. Um, now have ocean view soaking tubs as well. We have completed, and I'm sure many of you are aware, our over-the-water villas and our over-the-water bungalows. We have new five breathtaking over the water villas. Footage wise, they're about 1800 square feet and they all have private infinity pools. What you're looking at here is the interior and you have a glass floor right at the end of your bed where you can see the sea light. And I've been asked when I've done workshops, well, how many can this room accommodate? Remember, it's sandals, it's couples only. Yes, it's 1800 square feet, but this room accommodates two people. Okay, and literally 24 hour room service, you never have to leave these accommodations. There, as I said, the, the, there are the five um, with the over the water, uh, they're over the water bungalows with the infinity pools. And then we also open 12 amazing over the water bungalows. They're a little bit smaller, 1800 square feet, same layout as the villas. The difference is they do not offer the private pool. So again, five over-the-water villas, 1,800 square feet, and 12 over-the-water bungalows, and the bungalows would be the ones without the infinity pool. But here, you're looking at the villa. You could see yourself, I'm sure. You could see your clients staying here for the full time of their vacation and not having to leave the accommodation. Um, price point is gonna range for the villas anywhere from about 18 to 20,000, but I will tell you, suggestion is, when booking these, you can split it up. You can do four nights in maybe a club level room and the last three nights you can do in the over the water villa. A little bit different with these villas, they do require a $1,000 deposit. So normally that is not the, um, the, the case when you're booking non uh, bungalows or non villas, but for the villas they do require a $1,000 deposit when you're booking. So again, another visual and you can see how beautiful it is looking at that beautiful Caribbean ocean as you sit on your, your chase lounge chair or, or swimming in your, in your pool. Again, a visual, a better look at how open and airy it would be from the inside of these accommodations. Pretty magnificent. And I can assure you, you all have clients that would be willing to um, experience this type of vacation in Jamaica. I always say, you know, it's, it's our it's our South Pacific with a Jamaica flair. So they don't have to be on a 13 hour flight to get there. They can be there within a matter of four hours if you're, if you're traveling from say the Northeast region. But even if you're traveling from a further point somewhere in the US, it's worth every bit of the hours that you're on the plane to get to these amazing accommodations. Okay, we're gonna jump over now to Negril. Negril is about an hour's drive from the Sangster Montego Bay Airport. Um, it's on a seven mile stretch of a beautiful white sand beach. And it's the, we happen to be Sandals Negril, the longest, best stretch of Negril seven mile beach. We have Caribbean honeymoon beachfront two story, one bedroom butler suites that, are, that have, were redone last year. They're absolutely beautiful. Uh, what you're looking at here at Sandals Negril is a Caribbean honeymoon beach from two-story one-bedroom butler suite, which was always, always very, very popular, but we have completely redone these accommodations. So what you're looking at is a before, 
and this is what it looks like now. This is the Caribbean honeymoon beachfront, two-story, one-bedroom butler suite. So you have the, this is the downstairs, and then you have the upstairs, um, which is before, and this is what it looks like now. More airy, more open. Spiral staircase was nice, but it's a little bit, uh, set up a little bit differently than it was previously. Okay, again, the before, the bathroom before, and what it looks like now. This is your beachfront Grand Lux club level room. Again, uh, most of the club level rooms you'll find at our resorts in Jamaica will have the Tranquility soaking tub. And again, here's the beachfront Grand Lux. This is your area, uh, the exterior area with your Tranquility soaking tub. Caribbean beachfront Grand Lux club level room, again, with Tranquility soaking tub. Now we're going to go over to the area which is Sandals South Coast. You may all remember this used to be called Sandals White House. Um, it's about an hour and a half distance from the southwest coast section of Jamaica, about an hour and a half from Saint Montego Bay Airport. Um, this is an all beachfront, all luxury, all on Jamaica's south coast. Formerly, as I said, Sandals White House, 372 rooms and suites, 18 categories, 50 acres, and anywhere from an hour and a half to 75 minutes from the airport. The highlights is situated on an undiscovered 500-acre nature preserve. Um, all rooms and suites face the beach. So no matter what room category you're in, you will either have beachfront or an ocean view room. You're going to have some view of the sea, for sure. It's broken up into three villages. It's an Italian village, a French village, and a Dutch village. And I do want to mention that all of the rooms in the Italian village have been completely refurbished. So when you see me showing you the befores and the afters, um, the afters are all applicable in the Italian village. The French and the Dutch village are what the rooms look like before the renovations. And they're all still beautiful regardless. So again, this is Sandal South Coast. This is the Italian B Trunk Club Level Junior Suite, um, Italian village. This was a before, okay? And this is what, so therefore the Dutch and the French, the rooms still look like that. This is in the Italian village. Uh, this is a club level junior suite and this is what the visual of the room and the decor looks like now in that village italian beach trunk club level junior suite bathroom one bedroom butler suite italian village this is where you have your living area and a separate room would be where the bedroom would be okay slight changes with this as well a little bit more open a little bit more airy one bedroom butler suite again italian village before and a little bit airier now. Okay, I, I, not to be redundant, but again, in the Dutch and in the French, this would be your bathroom. Still looks like this, quite beautiful. But in the Italian, we've completely redone all the accommodations, so this is what the bathroom looks like today in the Italian. We have opened up some new restaurants at this resort. There's a sushi on the sand, where you can feast on the freshest sushi in this brand new ocean front setting. It's quite beautiful. Uh, sushi is very, very popular. The great thing about Sandals, we have gourmet uh, global dining. And the great thing about Sandals is everything is included. So for your customers who are apprehensive of experimenting with different food types when they're here at home because of the cost factor, it's never a worry when you're at Sandals. They can try different things that maybe they haven't tried before. And if they don't like it, it's no big deal. They don't like it, they try something else. But it gives you that opportunity uh, to experience with the five-star dining different types of cuisines that we, that we offer. Okay. Um, would like to show you that we are opening, uh, available for sale in November, over the water bungalows at Sandals South Coast. So we're very, very excited. And if you'll notice, it's a heart shape you can actually walk to them from the beach. So um, these will be opening soon and uh, they are available for sale for arrival starting November 1 of this year. And I tell you, they're selling out quickly. And if, you're good, if you look over to the visual, if you look over towards the left part of where the heart shape over the water bungalows are, you're gonna see something out in the water which is also over the water. And we have a chapel which you can't visually see, but what you're looking at there is our latitude. It's our over the water bar, which I think I should have a picture of that to show you too. These are the bungalows. They're quite beautiful. Again, about 
um, 800 square feet. You've got the hammock there. You're, you're visually um, in paradise right on the ocean. Um, they're quite beautiful. This is the interior. We still have the glass floors here uh, as we did for the ones at Sandals Royal Caribbean. So you can see the sea life as well, very open, very airy. And what we've opened were the over the water wedding chapel. This is brand new. So if you're looking to do groups, uh, destination weddings uh, for some of your clients, or if you're looking to do a retie the knot, uh, renewal of vows for some of your clients. You could suggest it to them. This is an ideal place for them to uh, share that ceremony with, with, with each other. This is the interior of the Over the Water Chapel. And this is what I was telling you about. This is Latitudes. It's our Over the Water Bar. Many of you may be familiar if you're seasoned. There's um, a great bar. It's called the Pelican Bar, which is in the south coast area of Jamaica. So now you're clients that are staying at our resort, no need for them to go to the Pelican Bar. We have our own over the water bar. And what's so cool about it, there are hammocks around the side. It's a great way to interact and have a good time and hang out with, with new friends and old friends. Or if you have groups, it's, it's a lot of fun. So it's where the inspiration for everything is new. Better picture of, of, um, of the over the water bar. And again, it's called Latitudes, but you can see how it's a great place to hang out. It's a fun environment. Uh, something new, and it's, I'm telling you, the, the, the guests love it. They absolutely love it. So all 112 rooms and suites in the Italian beachfront village, I just want to reinforce, have been completely refurbished, and the, the visuals of everything before is based on what the Dutch and the French rooms look like. There's also, I want to mention, a new jerk shack that was added. I mentioned the sushi on the sand as well. So continuous improvements are constantly taking place at our resort. Uh, I want to mention that over in the Ochi section, we have Sandals Ochi Beach Resort. Distance-wise, it's about an hour and 50 minutes from Sangster International Airport. We also have Royal Plantation, literally right next door to Sandals Ochi Beach Resort. However, it is an all-butler boutique resort, 73 rooms. Um, it isn't feasible to do the exchange privileges from Sandals Ochi Beach Resort to Royal Plantation because we couldn't possibly accommodate the folks at Ochi over at Royal Plantation. It's not large enough. However, if you have clients that are staying at Royal Plantation and they want to venture out and go over to Sandals Ochi Beach Resort, they most certainly can do that. But it doesn't, it's not reciprocated because of the size of the resort. And then there's also the Beaches Resort, which is, it's called Beaches Ocho Rios. I want to also mention that you have an option too to fly guests who are going in any, to any of the Ocho Rios resorts to have them fly into Kingston Airport. Transfers would be included. When we think of Jamaica, we often just think of flying into Sangster Montego Bay Airport, but don't dismiss Kingston as an option, especially for those clients that are going to the Ocho Rios section. Uh, I have a, a slide that you're looking at, which is talking about our upcoming overdrive unveiling uh, for 2017. If you haven't received an email for them, please um, try to come if you can. Uh, it's listed on our travel agent portal as to where they're gonna be held in different parts of the United States. Um, it's open to all of our travel agent partners and uh, our Jamaica Tourist Board partners will be there to talk to you even more in depth about Jamaica because we're gonna have a trade show and it's gonna be followed by a dinner and we're gonna tell you a lot of new and exciting um, things that are soon to come in Jamaica with the Sandals and Beaches Resort. So gear up for it if you're available to come. The dates are listed there, we'd love to have you. One of the things you wanna share with your clients is our Sandals Resort app. You want to encourage them to upload this app before they get down to resort. It's a great informational app where they can get information on tours, um, they can get information on restaurants, what days they're open, what days they're closed, Red Lane Spa. So it's an app that they should try to open before they get down to resort and once they're there they'll have accessibility to so much information and a means of communicating also uh, and get answers to questions instantaneously literally within 10 minutes. So that's something you want to encourage. Just go to your app store, it doesn't cost anything, and you can upload the Sandals Resort app prior to getting to resort. 
I want to talk a little bit about unique vacations. We um, have a very, very strong relationship with the Jamaica Tourist Board. And again, thanking uh, Chris for inviting me to present. But we, we also are partnered with JTB, Jamaica Tourist Board, with our travel agents. And we want to let you know that we have specials going on right now. We encourage you to take advantage of them. One of them is reserve your client's booking for $98 per room. Normally, the deposit, when you're making a reservation, is 200 per person at Sandals. It's a $400 deposit, but we're offering a, a promotion uh, right now, and it'll be applicable probably for the next 30 days, uh, where only a $98 deposit is required initially. So you may have that client which, oh, I don't have the $400 to put down right this second, but maybe 98 might be feasible, might be doable. So that's something you can let them know about. And within the next 21 days after paying the 98 deposit, we automatically would charge um, the the remainder to equal the $400 deposit. So that's brand new, but it allows that customer to just put a, book, a booking on hold um, if they don't want to make the commitment of the 400 right at that time for whatever reasons they may have. And then also when you book directly with us, meaning Unique Vacations, you earn an extra 3% commission on all bookings you make for your clients if you book online. So for example, if your commission, let's say, is 10%, by you booking directly with us, and if it's a butler category room, you're gonna earn 13% if it's butler. If it's club, you earn an additional 2% commission, so that will bring that 10% to 12. And if it's anything other than club, a luxury level room, a um, grand lux room, anything other than butler or club, you will earn an additional 1% commission. If you're a preferred sandals agency with us, which means you're at 15%, if you book a butler category room, you will earn 18% commission. So that's an advantage of booking directly with Unique Vacations. If you don't book with us, if you're booking through one of our partner tour operators, that's fine too. But it is very, very important to remember when booking through a tour operator, you must register the booking within 30 days after you make that reservation. That is essential because if more than 30 days elapses, you will not be able to register that booking. Okay. Uh, we work with you um, to help grow your business. The key resource that you have is our Jamaica Tourist Board partners to help you grow your business in Jamaica and learn about this beautiful country. And of course, your business development manager. We have over 50 business development managers in North America. In New York alone, we have three business development managers. So you can get support from us all of the time through webinars such as what we're doing right now, um, through the business development manager coming with a representative from the Jamaica Tourist Board to do a Caribbean night presentation for your clients, to do product update presentations, to give you updates, and of course our workshops that we have year round. We usually start them April of the, the, the April after first quarter. We never have workshops usually first quarter, so usually April of any given year and they go through September. So there's all sorts of resources available to help you grow your business. And of course, the travel agent portal, which is taportal.sandals.com, is a wealth of resources and it's available to you 24 seven. Many of you on the call may already have your cars wrapped. If you don't, it's something you can consider. It's a moving billboard. It's a way to give your agency more exposure, whether you're brick and mortar, whether you are a home-based agency, uh, the name Sandals and Beaches is recognizable. I mean, even if you don't know much about Sandals and Beaches, if you watch Wheel of Fortune, you see we give a lot of trips away to Jamaica um, at our resort. But by you branding your car with your agency logo and your agency information, you're giving more exposure to your business, which will heighten your business and, and impact the growth of your business positively to the Sandals Resorts in Jamaica. Uh, become a status symbol. You can advertise and promote yourself as a certified sandal specialist. It's just a matter of attending on one of our workshops, and you do have to attend once a year. If you book anywhere from one to 25 bookings, you are a certified sandal specialist. Once you reach the 26th booking, you become a certified sandal silver specialist. That's 26 to 75 bookings, and that's lifetime. That's not over a period of a year. That's lifetime. Once you reach 76 bookings up to 249, you're gold. And once you reach 250 or over, you become a platinum agent. The top of the line, which is based on yearly 
um, activity in terms of your growth. In other words, from January 1 of this year through December 31st of this year, if you reach 100 travel bookings within that year period, you become a Chairman's Royal Club member. And there are certain perks associated with being a Chairman's Royal Club member, even additional commission above and beyond what I've just explained to you. And um, incentives in terms of when you travel on property and the type of accommodations that you will receive. And if you go to a status of 250, it's Chairman's Royal Club Elite, and the top of the line would be the Chairman's Royal Club Diamond Elite, and that's when you reach 500 travel bookings within a calendar year. I, I know we have representation of groups on the line, and it's easy to achieve a goal of the status of 100. Do a couple of groups a year, and it can be done. And with sandals and beaches, five rooms constitute a group. You know, a lot of um, a lot of folks think it has to be a minimum of ten. Five rooms with us constitutes a group. So seasons of sandals and how to make the most of your year. Um, for the season agents, you know that from December really through to March is the season when you want to get involved in doing consumer shows, bridal shows. Caribbean night events, and that's when you reach out to your business development manager, manager the, the, the Jamaica Tourist Board representative. Um, for me, in this, I'm in the Northeast region, and I work very, very closely with Marcia Sinclair, who uh, represents New York State. So reach out to your representative from the Jamaica Tourist Board. Get involved in the things that they do to heighten the awareness of Jamaica and the Sandals Resorts so that you can grow your business. Um, the fall period from September through November is where you're going to set new goals. Try to put your marketing plan together and how you can grow your business in Jamaica. We will work with you to help put your marketing plans together uh, to get prepared for the new year. Spring, which is March through May, that's, as I mentioned, when we have our workshops. Usually they start in April, the beginning of April, and we go through the end of August. Sometimes we have a few in September. But you definitely want to attend our workshops. Uh, you want to reconnect with the resort general managers. We oftentimes have them come to our workshops. Um, and then you want to get involved with doing local training. We'll come to your offices. We'll bring a representative from the Jamaica Tourist Board with us. If you're a home-based agency, what the business development managers do, we'll they'll set it up at diners. We have about 10 agents come, and we'll do a presentation right at the diner. We'll use that facility um, for about an hour and a half, so we don't take you away from your offices too long but we are available to help and work with you to grow your business. We are your business development manager. And from June through August, you can join us for exclusive, exclusive agent um, events, the golf tournament, which is going to be held at Sandals Ochi Beach Resort. We have golf shows um, locally that you can get involved with, food festivals. Uh, Lady Sandals, by the way, is gonna be coming to the Northeast soon. That's Mr. Stewart's private yacht, and we invite our travel partners to join us on the yacht to accommodate you for various types of events. So it starts with our team, our members are on the phone. It starts with our partners with the Jamaica Tourist Board. We have a great reservation department. We have wonderful travel agent specialists that you as travel, our travel partners can work with. Uh, weddings, group weddings or individual weddings, you wanna, you wanna work with us because once you initiate the wedding, that's all you have to do. You can be as involved as you want or as little as you want because everything, every component of that wedding that your client does, you'll reap the benefits of the commission on that. So again, you can be as involved as you want or as little as you want, but anything before they arrive on property, you reap the, the rewards of that and you don't ever want to leave money on the table. We have a great loyalty program. Once one of your clients goes to Sandals one time, they become a Sandals select member, which is wonderful, and that gives them all types of perks and benefits for future trips. Uh, we have a great interline desk, a great butler department where you can communicate with the butler on behalf of your customer before they go down to property so that their needs are met when they go down to resort. If they are a fan of the Mets or a particular team, we're going to make sure, the butler's going to make sure all their needs are met in, in terms of the type of alcoholic beverages they like. Um, and be aware of all types of activities. They may want to do extracurricular activities they may want to do outside of staying at the resort in Jamaica. In terms of interactive voice recognition, it's fully secure to ensure your client's information is never exposed. Um, the system currently charges 45 days out. 
uh, this will now be optional, but our final payments are normally due 45 days out. So you'd have to call in final payment at that point. As payment is made, an automated email will be sent out detailing the transaction, and you have multiple payment options, whether it be bank or credit cards, et cetera. Every booking that you make, whether it's a butler, whether it's a club or non-club, Sandals and Beaches Resorts, when you book directly with us, directly with Unique Vacations, we will send out official document holders and luggage tags to your client. Something that went into effect as of May 31st of this year is automatic direct deposit. Not everybody is aware, the majority of folks are, but if, if you're new in the industry, please, and even if you're seasoned, you may not have been aware. I've spoken to a few agents over the past month, they weren't aware. We are now doing direct deposit. What this means, you're gonna get paid a lot faster than you were getting paid before. It's automatically gonna go into your account. We no longer are sending out commission checks. So if you haven't set your agency up for direct deposit, this is something that you must do. You can go right on the TA portal. We have the email address of where you need to send all the pertinent information referencing your bank. And as I said, the commissions will be paid. And this includes even with the tours, the Island Roots tours in Jamaica the commissions will be paid a lot faster than they were previously. And everything you see here, all that's bulleted, is the information that you will need to send to our accounting department, and within a day, it's done. You're set up for automatic deposit. Um, on the TA portal, there's new booking engines with many new features where you can filter pricing, apply add-ons. Um, you have the ability to look at calendars for dates for weddings, uh, ability to add insurance, ability to add frequent flyer numbers. So the TA portal this year was completely revamped. It's very, very user-friendly. Um, that's how you're gonna sign up for our workshop. That's how you sign up for the overdrive unveilings that are coming up this year. So please take a look at the portal, play around with it, learn how to use it because there are a wealth of resources on there. And sometimes if you cannot get through to your business development manager, maybe they're out of the country, maybe they're on the road, or maybe you can't get through to a representative from the Jamaica Tourist Board, a lot of times you're gonna be able to find the answers that you're looking for just by going on the portal. Uh, there's a new booking engine. It features three new designs to choose from, uh, choose from over 120 images, and it's all accessible now through the travel agent portal. You can track your bookings as an agency in terms of what level you are. If you're preferred sandals agency, did you reach that 26th booking? Um, you can see how far you are from becoming a Chairman's Royal Club member. So you're able to individually look at your status as a consultant when, when you access our portal. You can also send from the portal non-commissionable invoices directly from your computer to your customer. And you can view invoices with commission for your own um, reference, for your own needs. That's, you wouldn't send the commission information to your customer, but you can actually send that to yourself. You're able to do that. Uh, there's something called a digital photo album. Um, it's fantastic. You can cut and paste the link of the digital photo album, and you can send that via email directly to your client. No longer do you have to pay for postage to send out a brochure to the customer. So the video tutorials on the portal are created to assist you in navigating the travel agent portal. So if you're not familiar with it, it's very simple, but you need to learn how to use it. So you go on the portal and you, and you go through one of the tutorials and it's very, very helpful. We have online chat on the portal. You push a button and a live, you can have a live chat with our reservation staff at any time. You don't have to pick up the phone or wait for an email response. I know a lot of times you call in and you're on hold for a long period of time. You, to alleviate that, go on the portal. You can get, you'll get an immediate response to your question. Co-branding is something that if you haven't already set up, I encourage you to do so because at three o'clock in the morning when you're sleeping, if, if someone's in your geographic area and they happen to go on your website and you've set up the co-brand with Sandals and Beaches and they go on that, you, they go on your website, they click on the Sandals logo, um, they're actually looking at your co-branded site. It, 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 it literally looks as if they're on the Sandals or the Beaches website, but it is co-branded directly to your agency. So if that individual happens to book at three in the morning or five in the morning, you're gonna get commission on that booking. So there's a lot of advantages of being co-branded and it's automatically pre-registered. I mentioned the digital photo album. 
Um, it saves money on postage. And again, you can go right on the portal and look at all of this visually. They're fantastic. Mobile sites, giving you more ways to earn commissions through co-brand programs, um, even from your mobile site. So customized web banners, we have them all on the portal. So if you want to do some advertising through links, through web pages, um, or if you want to do something for a local penny saver, newspaper, local newspaper, you can look at the visuals and the creatives right on the portal and download them. I mentioned this before. I want to mention it again. It is essential that when you book any of our resorts, uh, you, you register the booking. You must do it immediately, and you cannot let more than 30 days go by. Um, the advantage of registering the booking is that you're earning sell-and-go nights, and these nights can be accumulated, and it will allow you to go down to resort at no fee. Um, you can earn marketing dollars to do consumer shows, wine and food shows, advertising, to pay your car note for a wrapped car. The marketing dollars are used to promote your business with sandals and beaches. You have first rights of refusal for fam trips and you're keeping up your certification status with us. So again, it's important. If you book directly with us, it's automatic. When you book through one of our tour operator partners, it's essential that you register the booking. And we are constantly giving back. The, the philanthropic arm of Sandals and Beaches is our foundation, which started in Jamaica. Uh, Mr. Stewart is a fifth generation Jamaican. His son is a sixth generation Jamaican. The foundation does a lot to enhance the education, the health, the well being of the citizens of the country of Jamaica. Um, if you want to get more involved or if you want your clients to get more involved, we do reading road trips that you can set up. There's all types of things that you can do. Uh, and, and sometimes the customer wants more than the ordinary trip, if you will. Nothing's ordinary with sandals, I will say that, but sometimes they want to give back. They want to do something different. So just know that these um, um, activities are available that you can share with your clients if they're looking to do something different. And we talk here about the foundation, our promise to the Caribbean, um, the women helping others achieve, and also the Bob Marley Foundation. I want to thank you. I think I went a little bit over my time, Chris, and I do apologize if that's the case. But I, again, I appreciate the support that all of our travel partners give us. I want to reinforce the fact that Jamaica is hands down one of the most beautiful countries in our world. And if you have not seen sandals in Jamaica recently, please make every effort to sell and to go down and see the resort. And we greatly appreciate all the business that you give us. Thank you. Susan, great presentation. Yes, um, lots of amazing uh, information shared. Um, I thank you very much. Um, as you said, we are running close to um, our end time, so let's get to as, as many questions as possible. Um, and as we all, I see some questions here with a lot of information shared. Um, the first question that I have is, will we have the um, deck available to share with the travel agents so they can use it as a resource to get into the other um, information portals? Uh, you're talking about the travel agent portal? Well, I'm asking if we can share this deck with travel agents so they can use it um, to, to as a reminder to not get into the travel agent portals. portals. Absolutely. Yeah, they can they can share. Yeah, every agent, every one of our travel agent partners has accessibility to the portal. Absolutely, every travel agent has accessibility to the portal. As a matter of fact, now with the portal, in order to do anything, including the overdrive unveilings that are coming up, workshops, each individual consultant has to have their own username or password. And that can be set up through whoever the owner is of the agency. You just have to log on to taportal.sandals.com. You have to go in to create an account, and you just follow the instructions on how to create the account. OK, perfect. OK, let me get through some questions here. Um, Uh, which resort can the beach can they do the beach wedding summer ceremony? Um, the, well, you know, I'm glad you mentioned that beach beach wedding ceremony can be done at any of our sandals or beaches resorts. It's a matter of preference of where you want uh, the ceremony to be. Uh, I didn't mention, and I I want to mention that we do have at the over the water chapel at you saw sandals South Coast, but we also have a church, an actual church at sandals. Montego Bay, which was completely refurbished this year. It's now air conditioned. Uh, it's a beautiful, beautiful church, which is an option for some denominations, which do require 
that the parties do get married in, in, a, in a, an actual church, so that's an option. But um, a beach ceremony can be performed, at, it's just worked out with the wedding department, it can be performed at any one of our resorts. Okay, perfect. All right, here's an interesting one. My host company and Sandals are no longer partners, which doesn't allow me to sign up for TA portal. Is there a way around that? And would I and I would like to attend the road shows, but I can't register. Okay, if, you, if the question saying the host is no longer in existence, my question then would be, what CLIA or IATA number is that travel partner working under? Uh, because if the host is no longer in existence, how are they how are they booking through what source? If not through the host that they were previously booking through. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think they're saying that they, I think they're saying that Sandals, well, well, I'll send you this question as well, but I think they're saying that Sandals and the host is no longer partners, so they don't have access to that host oh, to Sandals. Oh, I see what you're saying. So if, okay, there, yeah, if, if, this, if Sandals is no longer partnered with the host, there's really nothing we can do about that. If they're affiliated with the host that we no longer work with, and there are a few out there that we are not working with, there's no way that we would be able to, they, they're in, restricted from getting onto the portal. Uh, they, th we, that's, and there are a few um, organizations out there that we do not work with for reasons I really can't divulge or get into right now. But um, I will say this, that I've had agencies working with hosts that were really good agents, really phenomenal agents. And they did go out and venture out on their own. Some uh, established their own IATA number and some started working with different independent agencies, if you will, and no longer work with the host. And if they still work with the host that we no longer work with, there's nothing to say that you can't work with another host, if you will, when working and booking sandals and beaches resort. Okay? Absolutely, perfect. Okay, tons of interest in the car wraps. And I'll just, I guess, summarize all the questions. It is basically, whose car is going to be wrapped? What's the cost? Does Sandals provide the car? Okay, good question. <laughs> um, no, <laughs> Sandals does not provide the car. The car would have to be our travel partner's vehicle. And uh, there's two types of car wraps that you can do. One would be, and just to let you know, uh, to wrap a vehicle costs anywhere from $2,000 to $3,000. You pay not one dime. We wrap the vehicle for you with your agency name, your logo, and so forth. You can do the wrap only, or you have the option if, to do a wrap where you get reimbursed up to a maximum of $250. So example, car note is $500, car payment is $500. We will actually pay you up to $250. We're, we'll pay a maximum of 50% of the car note, not to exceed $250. However, those marketing funds have to be in your marketing bank. And in order for them to be in your marketing bank, you have to book with us because every time you book with us, funds go into that marketing bank. So we're pulling, you can't go to Macy's or Lord and Taylor or Saks Fifth Avenue and buy an outfit, but you can use it to promote your business. And promoting your business is getting your car wrapped. And so we'll pull from those marketing funds and every month you will receive a check from us. So the more you book, the more funds goes in your marketing bank and that's how your car note is paid or the payment for your car is made. Uh, but you, it would have to be you purchasing, you the individual travel partner, travel agent, your, it would have to be your vehicle. And it can't be more than four years old. So it's now 2017. So we'll wrap 13, 14, 15. Anything that's 2013 and higher, we will wrap those vehicles. Um, we will wrap those vehicles. Okay, perfect. All right, summarizing again. Um, lots of interest in workshops. Uh, so is there a cost to attend and how can I register? Yes, there is a cost to attend workshop that's thirty-five dollars. It's very much worth the investment. Um, we started them around April, beginning of April. They're almost coming to conclusion now. We do have a few more. Um, you can go right on the portal and look at all the workshops we have throughout the U.S. that are taking place. I know we have one this week that were taking place in southern New Jersey. I know we have folks on this call from all over. But yeah, you just go right on the TA portal and it lists all the various workshops that we have across the U.S. And as I said, we normally have them from April and they go usually until the end of August. That's our workshop season. And then we also have them when you go on a fan too. 
not all the fans have workshops, but many of the fans that we do have will incorporate a workshop and that will count for your certification for that year. And it, we do require that you attend a workshop once a year to take advantage of all the perks associated with booking sandals. Okay, that's a perfect segue into the next question is, are there any FAMs uh, scheduled? Uh, yes, we do have some rising star fans that are scheduled. In order to qualify to go to a rising star, you have to have at least one travel booking with us, just one. Um, and yeah, you can you can look those up on the portal as well. Um, there are various parts of um, this year, various resorts that are taking place at Barbados, um, uh, Saint Lucia, uh, Sandals. South Coast, they're all over. And then your your BDMs in your region, and again, I know we have folks uh, on this call from all over, but the local BDMs also put together fans where they take 15 to 20 agents down to resort. So reach out to your local business development manager to inquire about attending a fan. Let them know that you're interested in attending a fan. If you cannot attend a fan, go down to resort using your sell-and-go night. If you don't have sell-and-go night, go down to resort using the travel agent rate. A travel agent rate is going to range from $250 a night to $350 a night, depending on the resort. And in the in the long run, that is a, not a significant amount to pay for a sandal uh, resort, truly, or a beaches resort. And it, it's an education. It'll give you an opportunity to see the resort. And as I said, if you have not seen Jamaica, there's a lot to be seen. We're, we've been around for 35 years. I've talked to travel agents. It's been 10 years since they've seen some of our resorts. And you're, you won't even recognize the thing from 10 years ago as what it is today. Um, believe me, we, we are truly luxury all-inclusive. And take every opportunity. Use the travel agent rate. You can call our interline desk. They can check availability. They can book it for you. Use your sell and go nights. But definitely go to Jamaica to see our resorts. Okay. All right. So we have a ton, ton more questions to come. Um, we will get to, or we'll respond to those via email. Um, but let's okay. try and get to about three more. Um, so a group okay. question, or a bunch of group questions. So let me let me summarize again. Um, uh, can you share the group info again? And if I book a complimentary room, is that room up front, or will I be refunded after travel? And what do I get paid commission on? And is that with added added items, book upgrades, menus, tours, etc.? Yes. Uh, for, with 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 groups, I'm not going to get into the intricacies of groups because we do have a group department that handles a lot of group questions. But what I can do, yes, um, there's two different types of groups that we have. We have a group contract, which is a sort of luxury or what some companies call run of the house, and then we also have what's called group code. And if if you're doing smaller groups. A lot of agencies will do the group code. A minimum, remember I said a minimum of five rooms constitutes a group. Uh, I will say that we have an excellent team that handles groups. And what I'm going to do right now is I want to give you, and so this way they have this email address. If you have folks on the call that are interested in groups, you have the regional group sales manager who handles the west coast of the United States and the northeast. And his name is Mark. Shea. It's again Mark Shea, M A R K S H E A. His email address is M as in Mark, Shea, S H E A, at U V I, that's U as in unique, V Victor I India, dot sandals, S A N D A L S, dot com. So you can email him if you're in the west coast of the U.S. or the northeast. If you're on the call and you are in um you have we have um chris anybody from canada on the call um no just primarily u.s agents okay so the other group representative is sherry vaughn and sherry oversees the midwest mid-atlantic and southeast of the u.s again that's midwest mid-atlantic mid-atlantic does also include pennsylvania for the purposes of of uh, what what she handles in Southeast. And Sherry Vaughn's email address is S as in Sherry, Vaughn, V-A-U-G-H-A-N, at uvi.sandals.com. So it all ends in uvi, uniquevacationsinc.sandals.com. 
and it's the first initial and the last name of that particular manager. And if they need me to, if I, I can uh, quick email it to you just in case they didn't catch it so that they have it as a follow up if you want to send it to folks. Okay, so I see some um, Canadian agents responding that they're here. So if you want to share their information as well. Okay, uh, absolutely. Uh, the, the group representative, the group sales manager in Canada's name is Grant Lawlor. Uh, is, Grant is G-R-A-N-T and his last name is L-A-W-L-O-R. Uh, his email is a little bit different in terms of the ending as the ones I just previously gave. His email is again his first initial, which is G as in Grant, L-A-W-L-O-R at U-V-I Sandals, all together, U-V-I Sandals dot c a okay perfect all right last two questions um we are at the end um but i think it's two important questions to ask before we go so one is uh do the direct deposit go to the host agency first or is it straight to the agent's account and a little more on the sell and go program uh, direct, the direct deposit would go to, the, if you're affiliated with a host, and I'll give you an example of a host that comes to mind, NextGen Cruise Planners, okay? Those are two that come to mind. There's another one called KP, and I know there's several out there, but those are the three that come to mind. Cruise Planners, NextGen, KPT, I'm using these as examples. The direct deposits would go to the host, absolutely. And then, obviously, the host would send, um, uh, the the information or commissions for that matter to the individual consultant. Um, I hope that if you're an individual agency working under your own CLIA, working under your own IATA, the direct deposit would go directly to you. But if you're working through a host, it is going uh, it's going to go everything goes through the host. So the host would have had to set set it up the direct deposit for sure if they have not done so already. And I think most of our hosts are up to speed and have done that that I that I know that we work with. In terms of the uh, question, uh, which is very general about our sell and go program, the way it works, and again, you can go onto the TA portal and it explains it in more detail, but every time you book with us, um, you're, you're accumulating points. And those points equate to marketing funds, and those points also equate to um, nights that you earn to go down to resort. So to give you an example, if right now the way it's set up for a minimum of six nights if you book a butler category room that equates to one night where you can go down to resort if you book two nights in a club level room that equates to one night and if you book three nights in a, in a um, starting room category which would be luxury or premium etc you need three of those and that would equate to one night so uh before you book the more that you have, and those nights can be cashed in so that you can not cash it. No, that's wrong terminology. Those nights can be used for you to go down to resort and see and see our and see our property. But you do have a certain timeline that you need to use those. Using this year as an example, anything that's traveled, your clients that have traveled from January 1 through December 31st of this year, 2017, you can travel once they've traveled anytime this year. To recoup nights for sell and go, and you can carry that through until July 31st of 2018. Beyond that, you have to use the existing year's accumulation of your nights. Again, if you go into the portal and under the sell and go explanation, it, it's a little bit clearer. And if you have any questions, you can also reach out to Inside Sales or you can call your local business development manager. All right, perfect. Susan, we thank you once again for a great presentation, great information shared. Um, a lot more questions to um, to answer, so we'll get this over to you, um, and you can answer directly to the agents, or you can send all the, the questions back, or the answers as a group, we'll get them out to agents. Um, but okay. all in all, thank you for a great uh, presentation today and great information shared. My pleasure. Anytime, Chris. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. Thank you, agents, and talk to you again in two weeks. All the okay. best. Okay. Take care. Bye-bye.